Galacticos, I'm home for the holidays, which means I'm not in Madrid, I'm in California. But that's okay, we're gonna do an international pick the 11 and match preview. Me in California, Vitali in Madrid. So here's my starting 11 for the match against Real Sociedad tomorrow. I'm gonna go with Kedar Navas in goal, Baran is back, I'm happy about that. So I wanna see Baran and Ramos as the center backs. Out wide, I'm gonna go with Marcelo and Danilo. In the center midfield, you guys have been saying I never put Tony Cross in the lineup and I'm going to continue not putting him in the lineup. I'm going to go with Casemiro, Modric and James and of course up top, the ever so dangerous BBC. I'm not going to get too much into technical things, I'm going to let Vitali talk about that, but I do want to talk about the significance of this match for Real Madrid. It's important for us to win this match and end this year on a high note because we've had a really uh, roller coaster of a season. I mean, we have this new coach, Rafa Benitez. There's people who are happy that he's here, people who aren't happy that he's here, players or rumors saying that the players weren't happy in the locker room. And then we have injuries on top of injuries on top of injuries on top of injuries. <laughs> Plus, we had the loss against Barcelona at home, which was a little bit humiliating for us. And of course, the Sherry Gate, which led us to being eliminated from the Copa del Rey. I mean, it seems like it couldn't get any worse for us. I think that if we end this year on a high note, we can go into 2016 with the right foot forward or putting the right foot forward, however that saying goes, and continue to better this season. My predictions for this match. Like I said before, I don't think it's going to be such a high scoring match like against, like the match against Rayo Vallecano. I think it's going to be a win for us, but I'm going to go with a 3-1 win. Not a clean sheet either. We've been letting goals in. I think lack of concentration there, and especially in set pieces and in crosses. So they might get one in on us. So a 3-1 for us. Vitali, what do you think? Thank you, Ashley. This is my 11. We're going to see Keylor Navas, Pepe and Ramos. On the right, Danilo, I think he's lately proving that he can do a little bit better. And then on the left, Marcelo. In the midfield, Kroos, Modric and James. And up top, again, they're very questioned. There are a lot of doubts about it, but I think for this game, we have to see again the BBC. Bale, Cristiano and Benzema. Now, talking about the game, I think tactically there won't be much mystery to this game. Probably Real Sociedad is going to come here and play a very brave game plan. Maybe as Rayo, we'll see something similar, but I don't think they're going to be as brave as they were because that, as you know, we saw last week, is kind of a suicide plan, especially after Real Madrid scoring 10 goals. But we do have to look out for certain players. Xavi Prieto, Xavi Prieto always plays good games here in Bernabeu. There's Esteban Granero and there's Canales, you know, players with a little bit of Real Madrid history that's going to bring a little, a little something to the equation. And also, of course, Carlos Vela and Iyarramendi. So I think on paper, it should be again an easy home game for Real Madrid. Another chance to get three points without complicating things very much. You know, I'm not saying it's going to be an easy game, but it should be a comfortable win for Real Madrid. I think after this very strange year that we've had, it's a good chance for the players to close it on a good note, on a positive note, and you know, start 2016 with better sensations than what we're ending this 2015. So I'm gonna go with a prediction, and I think I've been saying clean sheets lately, and you know, seeing what we have seen, I don't think we're gonna have a clean sheet, but I think we are going to win. I'm going to say maybe a little bit ballsy, but I'm gonna say 5-1 for Real Madrid, and you know, close 2015 with a solid victory. So there you have it, Galacticos. Ashley said 3-1, I said 5-1, that was our prediction. Of course, you want to know what your prediction is, don't forget to leave it in the comments below. Hit like, subscribe, follow us on Twitter, Snapchat, Instagram, Facebook, we're everywhere. We're here at the Bernabeu, we'll be in Valencia for the next league game in 2016. Bye!